Hey guys, it's Derek with Survivalist. Um, in this video, I'm going to actually be going over some animals. Uh, one of the big things is the wolf. There's actually a little bit of information to be taken in from this. Uh, almost every continent has one. Um, the only things that won't have them is the North and South Pole. Only because it's really too cold. That's where you actually get the penguins and the polar bears. But um, I'll get into that later. Um, right now, wolves, they actually do pose a threat to humans, um, especially when they're in packs or, you know, protecting territory. Uh, well, attacks are rare, though. They do happen. Um, sometimes a little more frequently now than they used to, only, um, they, because of our ability to intrude on their territories a little bit more now um they do hit scavenge for human leftovers because they are scavengers um they're not really considered hunters that's their easiest way to actually find food and make sure they get fed especially when they have um babies or um young wolves i guess you can say um they and noticeably they are losing their fear fear of humans also. Um the greatest danger of attack is during mating season, basically when they want to start a family, pretty much. Um this varies depending this varies depending on where they are in the hemisphere. Um it could be early in the year, late in the year, mid year, uh, depending on which location you're actually gonna be in. Northern or he Southern Hemisphere, Eastern or Western, um, only because of different um, times that they actually do that. They have it. Um, the biggest thing is to make sure you watch out for their pups. Um, that's usually when mom is around, and that's their biggest thing is wanting to protect their pups from anything happening to them or being in any type of danger. Um, wolves tend to hunt in packs, like I have mentioned before. Um, this usually means that there's going to be two or more, at least, to be considered a pack. Actually, I think it'd be like considered three to a pack. Um, sometimes they could be close to eight or nine in a pack. Um, the biggest thing is they actually do surround their victims, so it's actually going to be a little bit harder for anybody to escape. Like, one move, you can't really get out anywhere, because you try to go one way, there's going to be a wolf there. Um, and that's how they usually do their attacks, is from various angles. So that way, you're basically surrounded. Um, so... When you actually get into a situation like situation like that, what you want to do is, you know, have a confrontation. Basically, make it look like you're, you know, the big guy right there. Um, the biggest thing is if you do try to run, they will actually attack because that's like their defense mechanism is when they see movement or anything like that, they'll go after that because they usually are hungry and they want to eat. And they usually do take down their prey very easily. Um, the biggest thing is to stand, the, stand your ground uh, by facing the animal and group together. So basically go back to back if, you're, if you have a few friends. But make sure you stand your ground and stare them down, basically. That's when... The intimidation actually really starts and that way it's like hey this is our ground you got to get out of here um be sure when you actually do that is to approach them aggressively if you do it passively they're gonna not they're gonna take you seriously um that's when they actually take the upper hand but if you do it aggressively that's when you have the upper hand and they actually stand down because it's like, hey, maybe we're in the wrong spot or, you know, something like that. Um, this will actually cause them to shy away, pretty much. 
Uh, if attacked, be sure to actually fight back with punches, kicks, um, or if you have rocks or sticks or anything like that, you can use that to your advantage too. The biggest thing is to actually go for their snout. Um, they absolutely hate that, and it'll actually hurt them a little bit more because that's their uh, main use is smell. So attacking that is basically taking away, you know, their strong suit. Plus, it'll actually make them shy away a little bit quicker. Um, other than that, I'm going to have a little bit more for animal attacks. So, hope you guys stay tuned. So, click like, subscribe, and I'll keep you guys posted.